Yo, what's up, my crazy subscriber? This is Joking John 34 here bringing us more Battlefield Highline Online here on PS4. Today, we're going to be talking about vehicles because apparently, this is a big problem here in Online Heist for uh, Battlefield Highline. Um, several times I've encountered people when they pick up the money, they'd rather run across the map than take in the car. Like, seriously, I parked the car right in front of their noses and they yet keep on running I keep I like honk the car so many times in front of their face they still don't budge I pray I hold R1 to tell him get in still no budge so what is going on here what is wrong with the population of Battlefield Hardline because it's supposed to be common sense you got the money the cops are gonna chase you down get your ass protected and the easiest way to do that is taking a car especially if it's armored you know if it's, if it's armored you're gonna be super you know super protected and a lot of people still don't understand that you know it's a super easy objective but yeah they make it seem like it was impossible like it's super easy all right just watch this little part that's why it, this gameplay only took me like around six minutes at the beginning i died like in like after playing it like for a minute and got like two kills out of it but then i noticed nobody brought cars and i'm like holy shit what is everybody doing here with no cars so i ended up going back into the beginning and uh, took the hq vehicle to the uh, to the heist part and you know it was a normal drop I was like wow this is you know this is what you all have to do but you all making it seem impossible so um so yeah it is common sense you know it's better for you to take a car to the destination than to go walking all right and the two vehicles you can trust the most will be the HQ vehicle which is the one I'm using for the criminal side and also uh, the armored SUV there's only two vehicles that you can trust the most, all right? And they do take a lot of hits. Um, it takes like around three grenades to actually get them destroyed, but only two to get them stalled. So, yeah, you gotta be quick. And by the way, they're super slow, but still, those are the ones that are gonna protect your ass every time you're playing heist. So take those vehicles, or have a friend take it to you, or drive together, park it somewhere safe, because you never know when the enemy's gonna try to, uh, to destroy it, so you have any transportation. And um, go for the money, or let, wait, let uh, somebody just wait in the car, go around in circles around the map, and come back for you when you pick up the money, and just transfer your ass out of there. It's a common sense game mode, but people make it seem impossible. I don't understand that. So that's my tip and strategy, guys. Just take a car. When you see the money bag, get out, go back in, reverse, and get the hell out of there, and go to the to the place they're pointing to in the map. So, and that's all you have to do. Okay, that's why this gameplay was like five minutes long, because I made it seem so simple. But yet, yeah, these people rather run in the middle of the streets and get their asses shot or get their asses run over by cops. And come on, man. So uh, that was a super easy uh, tips and strategy. Hopefully, you guys understand that take a vehicle, take a heavy armored vehicle with you all the time when you're heading over to crack the the, the vault or something. You know, every time you had to plant a bomb on the wall, take a take a bomb, take a car. You know, that's all you had to do. Super easy, simple, but yet people don't do it. Like, okay. <sighs> people just like impossible life, you know. They really do. So that is it. Uh, leave a like, leave a comment. If you guys got any questions about this strategy, which there really isn't supposed to be any because it's a common sense thing. You know, you had the money, the cops are going to chase you, so you got to have some transportation to go away. That's it. <laughs> so subscribe for more. You guys want to see more Battlefield Harlan gameplays and also tips and strategies.